Hey, what is up, guys? Welcome back. So today I'm excited to bring you guys something a little bit different.、Um, I also have a little bit of news to tell you guys. So actually, I've quit playing Monster Super League altogether. I don't think I can ever go back. Ever since I started playing this new game,、um, you might be wondering what this game is, and I just wanted to introduce the new game to you guys. This game is called Sliming Simulator 6000. It's a beautiful, beautiful game, and Basically,、um, you might you might if you look at the initial screen of the game, you might think that it really resembles Monster Super League, but that actually might be because、um, you know a lot of these phone games are all really really similar. And I want to just kind of tell you guys why this game is so awesome compared to Monster Super League. Now, this game,、uh, what you need to do in this game is very very simple. It's it's just almost exactly. Just like Monster Super League, but there's a few things that are a little bit different, and this, the gameplay of this game is just amazing. The graphics, the gameplay, and most of all,、um, you know, the ability to utilize my mechanics and strategy in this game、um, is just so much better than Monster Super League. Now, in Monster Super League, you would have to, whenever you go in and you do some battles, you would, you could. Do your you know twenty times auto auto battle or anything like that? You can't do that in Sliming Simulator. And in Sliming Simulator,、um, you have to really use your skills. You have to use your mechanical skills and make sure you make all the right right mouse cl clicks. You know all the right mouse movements、um, at at the same time. If you're playing on game, the game the it might be slightly easier because you know it's harder to control control your、um, your your gameplay、um, with the mouse. And it might be a little bit easier for you to play on a phone, but the the advantage of、um, playing on a computer is you might be able to enter a loading screen faster. And this game, Sliming Simulator, is all about speed. It's about how fast you can catch slimes. And you know, you might think that the catching mechanics is really similar to Monster Super League. You know, they have events and stuff where you where you need to catch things.、Um, you know, it 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 is really similar. I will I will admit. But the the whole difference is,、um, you don't do any part of your battles auto. You're basically spending your entire time catching. You know, so unlike Monster Super League, where you can only kind of play the game, like you, you can only really play the game whenever a rare or variant monster comes up. In Sliming Simulator, you can play the game. Like you can always play the game. You can always be active. Al always be here. Like you know, actually using your hands to actively play the game. Um, and that's amazing. That is just incredible. You know, I've never, I never seen a, I never seen a game. You know, one of these like farming auto battle games.、Um, you know, like monster collecting games. Be able to do that. Be able to,、um, you know, have to. I guess kind of, kind of make players have to utilize their mechanics, utilize their skills, and to actually come ahead. Because sliming simulator is all about.、Um, You know, it's all about that. All about that time. It's it's about how much time you can use. You can、um, put into, you know, actually catching the slimes and stuff. And the best part of this game is catching slimes isn't even the most like important part of the game. You know, if you guys ever played World of Warcraft or anything like that, you'll know that the game actually starts like end game actually starts whenever you finish leveling. So think of catching slimes as like the leveling portion of this game. The The actual other half of the gameplay, you know, the late game of the gameplay, is actually you can actually turn these slimes,、um, you can evolve them together, and then you use your resources. You know, these these little、um, yellow circles. You know, they you use these yellow circles to turn the slimes into bouncers. Look at this. Isn't this amazing? You can turn the slimes into bouncers, and the whole point of the game is to increase this. This is your overall point. You know, the more points you have here, the better player you are. So what you want to do is you want to increase your points as much as possible. I just actually noticed a little bit that my points aren't very visible.、But、you want to have as many points as possible, and this is the、um, these yellow circles. Are what you use to increase your points, basically. So you turn your slimes into bouncers. You know, like bouncers are amazing, and you get you get points every time that you you can turn you turn the slime into a bouncer. You get more points, and the the points that you get is all part all the best part of the game. So 
I, I use a little bit of more of these yellow circles and I'm able to get another bouncer. Isn't that, isn't that great? I just got another bouncer. Uh, I got 10 more points. Look at that. Ooh, that, that is amazing. All right. We're here again. We're here again. We're going to make a third. We're going to make a third bouncer. All right. I've already made two. I'm going to make a third one. Boom, right here. Third bouncer. This this game's amazing. Like it just it feels so satisfying. Like there's so much there's so much payoff here, you know? Being able to um turn these slimes into bouncers using these gold circles and then getting points every single time. You know, just really feels fills you with a sense of satisfaction, a sense of reward. And here here comes like the ultimate part. Like this is the final stage of the game where you use even more of these yellow circles and you use four bouncers and then you can turn these bouncers into a king slime. Isn't that amazing? And the, the coolest part about turning bouncers into clean king slimes is you get a, you get a total or you get a, you actually get 60 points every time that you turn three bouncers into a king slime. So every time that you turn four bouncers into one king slime, you get a total of um, 100 points, you know? And the coolest part about this is there's no limit to how many points you can get. So you can actually go back and you can start this game all over again. You can play for hours on end, nonstop, for your whole entire day, you know, just, uh, you can, like, it's, it's great. You can, you don't even, like, in Monster Super League, you're not really actually able to play the game because, you know, the auto battle does things better for you. But there's no, you can't auto battle this. So you would have to use your skills, your timing, your mechanics in order to um, do this as efficiently as possible. And you can start again. You can start another round and catch more slimes and turn, turn those slimes into bouncers and eventually get another king slime for a total of 100 points. Now, um, the coolest part, like the absolute coolest part of this game is you don't actually have to download another app to play this game. You can actually use your Monster Super League app to play this game. So it's actually, um, it, yeah, you don't have to download anything, you know? You can actually just use your Monster Super League app to play this game. Like no other Android game in, in the history of any, any app um, have been able to utilize this technology, like fitting their own in game into another game without even creating a game. Like that, like my, my mind is just blown right there. Um, so if you're, ex if you're as excited as me, if this game, if this gameplay seems really, really appealing, I definitely encourage you to start playing today. Like, this game is just the best game I've ever played. Um, remember, this, the game is called Sliming Simulator, if you can't find it. If you want to download the app to play this game, um, all you need to do is download Monster Super League. All right? So, that's pretty much it. Um, thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I hope you guys enjoy this game as much as I do. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.